Hey guys, welcome back. It's Finit Designs here with a brand new Affinity Publisher beta tutorial. In this video, we are going to be learning how to use the place image tool and also the place frame or picture frame tool. And uh, that's basically going to allow us to import images into our document. So let's go and click on the place image tool to bring up the uh, import dialog box. And uh, we can go over to our folder for images. And then let's go to photo and uh, select an image that we want to import. Um, so we can uh, either click and release to import the image at its full resolution, or uh, we can also, um, if we were to just click and drag the image into uh, our document, we can scale according to your own uh, preference. So let's say I want this size. Um, I can drag and release and there we go. We have the image in place now The second way to import images into our document is through the picture frame tool So if you go down to the next page, uh, we can we can create picture frames So let's drag out a couple boxes uh, one like that and uh, Now to actually fill in the boxes with the picture We will use the other tool place image tool and select two images that we want to bring in and click open and if you can look on the left side, we have another uh, a, a row of images or another tab that's opened up for us and it's called place images. And we can see the two images that we imported in and now we can select an image and then click in one of the picture frame boxes. And if we just click and it will be scaled according to that box. We can do the same thing with the second image, select it in the place images uh, menu and then click in the picture frame box and it will scale it according to that size. Let's say we want to scale this image and we can do that by selecting it and using the controls or anchor points on the corners and holding shift to constrain it. We can increase the size and let go to increase it. And uh, we can do the same thing with uh, the second one. There we go. We have increased the sizes. 